So this is ninja training going on? <laughs> yeah. Well, this is all military close quarters combat stuff from Japan's pre-unification Civil War period, so like 1600 AD and before. Really, the stuff that we do is based on timing, positioning, tactics, and psychology rather than speed and power. I was hoping you'd just show us like, you know, what a ninja would do if I tried to attack them. <laughs> okay. Is now the time to tell Adam Dale is 15th, Dan, and there is no 16? Well, hopefully Adam won't get hurt too badly. A little bit is good. Just do whatever. Okay. <laughs> Adam hits the mat in record time. I was to do it so that I locked him up. <laughs> As he falls, Dale gives Adam some pointers on the way down with the famed ninja throwing star. I wasn't actually using the points, oh. just this, but it would <laughs> say ripping out here. Ow. Right? Yeah. And we took him down. Okay. I had it in oh, here, too. Right in the back. That's good. The point where he fell down, I was ripping across here. And, I, <laughs> and he came down at a point where he actually was landing on it like this on the back of his neck. That's pretty efficient. It's Jamie's favorite part, watching me get kicked and my ass kicked. Adam and Jamie has enjoyed his schooling in the art of the shadow warrior. Can you come back to our shop and do some of this on high-speed camera Yeah, we'd like to. Awesome. OK, I'm done. <laughs> Next, Adam disappears to get some covert essentials. Hello, how are you doing? Very good, how are Welcome you? Welcome to Tiger Claw. There's even a martial arts superstore, and it has plenty of mercenary merchandise to choose from. All right, the Ninja Row is down here. The Ninja Row? <laughs> That's great. Just check out some of their red light saboteur specials. These are called tabby boots. They have the split toes, mm -hmm. so you can climb up ropes and stuff. Oh, and they're very silent. The Ninja Foot Spikes. They're great for walking on ice and for aerating your lawn. <laughs> we have shuriken. You need lots of shuriken. Every ninja has many shuriken. Are these are rubber shuriken. Well, the metal ones are illegal. <laughs> and for the totally 80s enigma. This is like wearing a t-shirt that says Witness Protection Program. <laughs> All undercovered out. That's the whole thing? The whole kit. It's back to the lair to test their three ninja myths, beginning with the tale of running on water. Well, barring any magical powers, which we can't really test on this show, ninjas definitely didn't just walk on water. But they might have had some help. Our researchers have turned up a thing called Mizugumo. So I'm going to build a set of these and see how effective they are. Mizugumo, meaning water spider in Japanese, were flat wooden discs that ninjas strapped to their feet. The theory is the wide surface area distributed their weight evenly on the surface of the water, so they didn't sink. So what kind of wood would a ninja cobbler have used? I've got some pine-based light density fiberboard here. It's pretty much perfect for our uses, so I'm gonna use this as our stand-in for the Mizugumo wood. Adam measures and cuts out two circles of pine board. Then he slices each of them into four separate pieces. That's good. One by one, he stains the sections with a brown pigment and painstakingly sands them back. Paint on, paint off. Such is the mysterious way of the former movie prop maker who, for no particular reason, wants his water shoes to look worn in. Looks a bit like old wood now. Lastly, he places a rectangular block in the middle of each circle and secures the pieces together using twine. It's an ancient jigsaw that makes for a puzzling pair of footwear. I didn't expect it to fold like that, but I wonder if that's not actually part of its function. Jimmy Choo can rest easy, but these replica ninja shoes may just float like boats. I can't wait to see how these work. All right, we know ninjas have speed and quick reaction time. This myth is about strength. Ideas and ninjas being attacked by a swordsman. Swordsman's coming to swing at his head. Ninja catches the blade in his hands without cutting his hands and without being chopped in half. You mean like this? 